Hi, I'm Ian Dunbar from the Fire Service College. My role here is I'm Head of Firefighter Core Skills and we're about to enter a virtual world using the flame train system. Can you explain what you're doing yeah. at the moment? So, I've made entry into the compartment. I can see a, a gas layer above me. I'm just going to cool some of these gases. I try and look for the seat of fire. I have information to say it's in one of the bedrooms. I don't know the layout, so I need to orientate myself. It's getting a bit warm. So I can feel heat through the heat vest. And I think I can see the room of origin. So I'm just going to make my way down the corridor. Gas cool it as I go. At this point, I cool the door. I'm going to send a radio message to update entry control. And I'm going to open the door. And now I'm in the room of origin. I can feel the heat. I can really feel the heat through the vest. I'll make progress and set the seat to fire. I'm happy. You uh, are either acting tired or are tired. I am. Um, I'm not acting at all. I have to say, the uh, the haptic feedback in the hose is very realistic. So, I although I was kind of moving electronically through the uh, through the compartments, actually the, the the burden of carrying this is very very realistic. So. The reason I'm out of breath is, is by virtue of exactly what, what I'm trying to achieve. How can so, this uh, support uh, training? Uh, I don't think we can ever replace exposure to hot fire, and this system is not designed to do this. But I think acquisition of skills is fantastic for people to learn bread techniques, gas cooling techniques. Um, it's a very, very uh, efficient way of training people because you can have a very quick turnaround between users. It's very quick, it's very safe. Also, you're reducing the burden on the organisation in terms of equipment, resources and people. Um, and also, you're reducing the uh, exposure of people to carcinogens and, and, and toxic nature of, of gases and, and burning carbonaceous. So, it's, uh, yeah, I'm still out of breath. But that's, that's more about talking now than, uh, than dragging this thing around. So. Thank you.